Let's take a look at the number of atoms in CuSO4. This is copper to sulfate. So when we look at CuSO4, the copper doesn't have anything after it, but the subscript is one. We don't write it, but it's there. So one copper atom, same for sulfur, one sulfur atom, and then four oxygen atoms. If you add these up, four plus one is five plus one, six total atoms in CuSO4. Sometimes you're asked to find how many atoms are in one mole of CuSO4. In that case, if you want to figure out how many copper atoms are in one mole of CuSO4, you just multiply that one by Avogadro's number. That tells you how many copper atoms are in CuSO4. Since we only have one sulfur, same thing. For oxygen, we have four oxygen atoms here in CuSO4, so we would take four and multiply four times Avogadro's number, and that would tell us how many oxygen atoms we have in CuSO4. If you wanted to know how many total atoms, you would multiply six by Avogadro's number. This is Dr. B looking at the number of atoms in CuSO4, copper 2 sulfate. Thanks for watching.